Most ND functions can be operated with the EFIS control panel. The range selector changes the ND range from a minimum of one half nautical mile to a maximum of 1,280 miles. At this time, the range is 40 miles. Turn the range selector clockwise to increase the range. At 10 miles range and higher, each position multiplies the range by 2. When you turn the selector counterclockwise, each position divides the range by 2. Use the range selector to show the maximum range. Below 10 mile range, the range selector shows ranges of 1 half, 1, 2, and 5 miles. When the airplane is on or close to the origin or destination airport, an airport map is shown. We'll talk about the airport map in a different part of the lesson. This map is shown in expanded mode. More of the flight plan route is in view in front of the airplane. The center switch changes the map between expanded and centered modes. Push the center switch. In centered mode, the airplane is in the center of the map. You can see more of the map area behind the airplane in this mode. In expanded mode, the full map range is shown in front of the airplane. In centered mode, half of the map range is behind the airplane. A scale on the track line has marks at increments of 25% of the total range. Numbers are shown by the marks at 50% of the range. The PFD minimap is always set to show 20 miles in front of the airplane. The weather radar, traffic, and terrain map switches let you show weather radar, TCAS, or terrain data on the ND and the minimap. Push the terrain map switch. Range arcs are shown when a map switch is selected and the ND is in expanded mode. Weather radar and terrain data cannot be shown at the same time. Push the weather radar map switch. Weather radar returns replace the terrain data. Now push the traffic map switch. A TCAS range ring with a 3 mile radius shows around the airplane symbol when the map range is 80 or less. These map indications and a number of other data items can also be controlled from the ND drop-down menu. You select the menu keys with the ND mode selector and mode select switch. Use the ND mode controls to remove the weather data. You can use the ND mode selector and mode select switch to control all of the items in the drop down menu. When the cursor is on the ND, you can use the MFK cursor controls as an alternative to the EFIS ND mode controls. Use the MFK to show the VSD. When the VSD is in view, the map area is compressed. You can also use the CCD to move the cursor and control the ND keys. Remove the VSD. When the VSD is removed, the map area fills all of the display again.
Backup EFIS controls are also available for some ND indications. Select the EFIS DSP key. Make the EFIS controls active. Keys are shown for range, map mode, and weather, traffic, and terrain data. Use the EFIS backup controls to change the map range to 20 miles. When the backup EFIS controls are selected, the EFIS control panel cannot be used.